friends welcome to excel beginners and advanced tips today we will see how cell can be formatted with VBA application and therefore we need to open excel you can see this is unformatted text in the cells are unformatted and ABC company limited I have taken a name as per instance is the heading and the field names are EMP code name address contact salary of employees and what we need we need to format this heading and the field names like this automatically in with the help of excel vba like this so let us start friends just delete this you can see abc company limited is the heading taken here and its font name is arial and font size 18 and it has been merged through a to A1 to E1 cell A, B, C, D and E this is the heading and cell A2 EMP code field name B2 employees name address contact number salary so let us start just deleting this and unmerge it and going to sheet 1 it is also it is to delete also we will create automatically the heading as well as the column headings or field names so let us start suppose we are taking again and therefore therefore we need to go to developer tabs and visual basic application and we need to insert a module create a module we need to create a module that means a function and we are giving the name of this function that is uh, sub procedure because caps lock is on sub format cell data okay sum not sun stm uh, sub this is the sub procedure and here we will write the code to get our desired result <coughs> and at first we need heading heading at column heading at heading starting from a1 reference Okay, the heading name given was given that is A A B C Company Limited heading and for this we go to sheet write the code sheet one dot range within quotes A one cell address dot a1 will be assigned as abc company limited sheet 1 dot range a1 is equal to abc company limited sheet 1 dot range a1 cell in a1 address will, will be replaced by abc company limited And now we need to merge it. Here it will be merged through A1, B1, C1, D1, E1. So A1 to E1. Okay. Let us let us view. Let us see what happens if I run this macro. S 
just see ABC Company Limited has been inserted. If you delete it, again you go to macro, run macro, and run it with F5 keys and see view sheet 1 ABC Company Limited has been inserted. Okay, again you delete it. Now, just undelete it for better reference. ABC Company Limited, undo it. And now we need to merge it. We need to merge it from A1 to E1, up to A from A1 cell up to E1 cell. That's for that we need to select it first and then merge it. So go to the code. Sheet one dot range within quotes A1 to E1 dot select ok quotes close we have to close the quotes and now I am copying this a1 to E1 range and dot yeah, you can you can you can you can write it uh, selection we have selected this we have selected this range E1 D1 and now we will merge it we can write selection dot Mars cells is equal to true. Okay. And let's see what happens when we run this module. See the cell cells has have been merged. It has been converted into one cell from A1 to E1. And now we need to place, we need to align this at center and color it and size or change its formats we automatically with VB application. So let us do that. Sheet 1, sorry, it's H sheet one dot cells sheet one dot range a one within course within course a one a one dot horizontal alignment is equal to Excel center so here the horizontal alignment has been done as center and for and if we run this we will find that ABC Company Limited will be aligned center so let us let us uh, view this run it and again we go to sheet 1 and ABC Company Limited has been aligned as center and now we have to increase its font size go going to code sheet 1 again writing the code sheet 1 dot range within quotes A1 dot font we can change the name of the font also suppose we need name font name within course C A L I B R Calibri font will be changed or uh, Arial we can say Arial Arial whatever we want and now we copy this code 
from this up to font font up to font and again placing it after placing it below and font size font size is equal to uh, set 18 and again bold we can also bold it font dot bold just see the code codes true and we can also color it again font up to copy up to font and replace it and then font dot color is equal to red vb red we have to write vb red okay so we have given some format we have given some attrib uh, orientations you can say the orientations uh, on abc compound limited on this text of sheet one so let us see what happens if we run this module run and now go into sheet one and you can see that all our desired formatting has been done that is the abc component limited the, uh, the text is center aligned it fonts style its font style has been changed its fo it font name actually it fonts name has been changed to arial and it has been bold color has been red alignment already done okay friends this is the code to change the font style color size alignment with PBA application. Hope you enjoyed this latter part. We will we will uh, going for the field names uh, automatically. Like uh, that will be that will come under ABC Compile Limited. Suppose EMP EMP code. EMP name uh, sorry EMP name not required name okay address contact number contact salary etc and the I am typing this at present but with the help of VBA code we can insert all the field names uh, automatically like ABC Compound Limited with the codes and the I and the latter part I will show you how to do that automatically with PBA application so thank you friends thank you very much and if you take if you uh, find it little beneficial then please subscribe our channel we are trying to learn share our views our knowledge of excel vb application here thank you very much